Bonjour ni hao! Welcome back to the Game Boys channel. I'm Johnny. And I'm Tim. And today we're here with the Box, box swap. swap! So we were so excited and thankful to have been included in this Box Swap, the 12 channels of Christmas. And our wonderful host for this video is our good and new friend, Disney Mertz! Yeah, Nicholas. So thank you, Saint Nick, oh, that's for cute. putting this together. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are obviously 11 other channels besides us in this so we will link everyone down below so be sure to check out everyone's videos and be sure to check out who we sent our box to yes and i we have an idea based on the return address of who this beautifully and lot heavy i will say yeah this is this the box says it's 16 pounds but like this feels almost at least like 25 because <laughs> like it feels like half a plate so what's funny is this person loves tape as much as i do and I, they actually wrapped the box and then put tape all over it so it's probably gonna be a little hard for giants to get into this so while he's getting into it I will just kind of go over a little bit of the criteria. So um, Nicholas just kind of had um, a bunch of different options for the criteria. So I know one of them is a gag gift. There was um, kind of like scented, maybe like candle kind of thing or some cozy items, which is like, you know, like sweaters or sweatshirts and some like candy some stockings kind of thing. I feel like this is one of those like mystery gate like mini games where it's like I'm slowly detangling like the threads of like <laughs> you know when you detangle Christmas lights and you're like all right where is next in this? <laughs> but this wrapping was so cute. I love this paper and was, everyone was commenting on it when he picked it up at the P.O. box. <laughs> yes I walking out at our P.O. box with a lot of Disney merchandise people are always like what is happening? <laughs> and normally real talk I'm all I'm like pointing something at you I'm sorry. Um, normally real talk I am always wearing like a Disney backpack or like a Loungefly backpack I have my Loungefly wallet so like <laughs> I already look like I love Disney a lot by my person <laughs> so just getting more boxes is always exciting oh it's so pretty uh, okay so the same wrapping paper on the inside open me first <laughs> so we have a card oh this is pretty it says, Oh Joy, with a Mickey on it. Alright, so when you open it, it says, Merry Christmas, Tim and Johnny. We were so excited when we were told we were shopping for you. Even though you are hard to shop for. <laughs> True. Your Disney collection is incredible. If you have any of these items, feel free to re-gift. Um, so this is from Haley and Tommy over at Magically Mickey and More. And we love their channel. They're new friends of ours. So. And they do a lot of content like us. They do a lot of unboxings. They do a lot of haul videos. Yeah, uh, some tags and yes. stuff. So be sure to check them out. They're super sweet and they're a lot of fun. Um, so it says, red paper is a gift for us both. Teal paper is a gift for Johnny. Blue paper is a gift for Tim. And then she just said, um, or they just said, thank you for bringing so much magic to the internet. Love Haley and Tommy at Magically Mickey Moore. Oh, thank you guys. That's so sweet. And thank you for bringing your Disney magic to YouTube and the joy of you, your love to the interweb. It's, yeah. it's been so great doing this swap that Nicholas put together as well as just this year. Our YouTube family of Disney community members has grown. Mm -hmm. There are wonderful new channels and it's been so great to get to meet and see new people. Yeah, definitely. And you did not need to get us separate. No, channels. no, no, no. We always feel so bad when people do that. We're like, we're one channel and like we can we can easily share. Like we <laughs> share real talk, like ears. We share everything except, actually we do share clothes. <laughs> so like we pretty- well, sometimes. Sometimes. I'm we, a little bigger than that. We, sh <laughs> but sometimes, real talk. I've actually shrunk clothes to get them to fit me. <laughs> oh, I love it. That you're this, but this box is already so generous and thoughtful and yeah. kind. So thankful. Uh, so thank you for putting this together. All right. Yes. Uh, so there's a massive one on top that says a gift for you both. Oh my gosh! Holy when you cow. lift this up, it is just oh, covered I have, I have to with show stickers. It. Oh my god, this is heavy. That's what I told. You. But look at how pretty they wrapped everything up in a bunch of stickers that we're gonna love to use. 
So wait, what is the color coded system? So yours is teal and mine is blue. And the joint stuff is red. So yeah. this Should is red. Should we say that for last, maybe? Yeah, let's. Well, it's on top. And there's stockings. Okay. Well, let's just. Okay. okay. A gift for you both to use when you get back to the parks. Ooh. Oh, it's a backpack. Ooh, oh, and we, you're, we don't That's have this so print. Cute. Oh, this is cute. We have. That's really. Cute. We there's a, a villain backpack that Tim got a long time ago in a bibbity box, I think. But we, this is a different print, and now mm -hmm. you and I can both match. And what's funny is we actually have the. Um, little pouch in this fabric and we love it so having it as a backpack that's amazing so now we both can wear backpacks and both rock different villains look. oh cute and i love that this is for both of us because backpacks <laughs> we do share with each other especially like these and i love the color blocking on this between like the black of this and then with the purple and the detail of all of these uh, this print, the fairest of them all. I think this was also a lot, another bag they did. All of the villains and little icons. This reminds me of the pin set that they did for, with all of the villain, the mystery pins with the emblems. Do you remember that one? Mm -hmm. But there are so many Easter eggs in this. This is beautiful. Oh, and then I believe the inside of this will be the black and white stripe. Yeah. The, these canvas bags that are like a traditional book bag are always good. And I actually, instead of using these at the parks more, I use these actually for travel because this pouch here, especially in this size, I don't use for a laptop, even though it's padded and you could. I use it for shoes and use this for like an overnight bag for like just sleep like a single night away. Yeah, so that's awesome. And then um, showing all the stickers that we got off, they stuck to our favorites. So we have like a bunch of little mermaid ones. Oh, this one's so cute. And then, yes, Happy Catterday, ah, ah. love. Oh my God, these are amazing. And some Sleeping Beauty ones and some villains. We can't get enough of stickers. Super cute. So thank you guys, that was an awesome first item. All right, so there's a lot of little confetti. Um, oh, this one says, Tim, open me last. Relax. So. Oh, there's a okay, teal one and a blue one. Your teal. There you go. So super cute wrapping paper. I'm living for this. And then his is cute too. I love thematic color blocking wrapping, so well done. Beautiful job. I love it. I think I know what this is. Ah! Yay! Yay! It's a mask. Ah, and lavender is our favorite. It's so soothing and comforting, when, especially on a Sunday night. So Johnny and I both got this same villain's mask that's lavender. So that's going to be really nice to have on a Sunday night. So perfect! Yay, twinsies! Yay! So, it, actually, this is perfect. I'm wearing red, <laughs> Tim is wearing green. Aww. Let's get a cute little stocking that These matches are our outfit. How did you know that we were going to be <laughs> wearing red and green? That's funny. Oh my god, and it's literally the green plaid. <laughs> oh no, we were naughty! There's lumps of coal! <laughs> so this is probably the gag gift. Ah, that's, that's funny. funny. So we have our coal. It's very Johnny. <laughs> Were you naughty or nice this year? I was nice. I'm always nice. <laughs> <laughs> and then it does have a little Rice Krispie Treat in there. Oh, two of them. Which we love our Rice Krispie Treats. Oh, so that's so nice. That is so cute. It's been wonderful having all of the hot, it's that time of year where there's holiday sweets around whenever yes, you want them. we've been eating so much. <laughs> and I think this stock, this another stock, and I think this is for both of us as well, in this really pretty pink, oh, there's princesses on it. Aww. This is cute. Cute. <laughs> there, the princesses. Interesting choice that they used Aurora in holiday pink, Snow White, and I get Belle. I don't know, I, that one's a weird choice. I wouldn't have put snow there, I would have put Cinderella, but that's just me. 
Oh, love her though. Holiday Aurora, look at her. And inside there are delicious sweet treats. All right, we have, oh my gosh, they must have gotten the whole box of Rice Krispies because they keep going. There's more. Oh, um, the chocolate and um, the candy um, canes. Yes. We love these kind of ones. It's those so fun too. Those scream Christmas to mm -hmm. me too. I always used to get those in my stocking. Mm -hmm. Oh. <gasps> oh my God. This these is, are cute. I know this is from Rudolph, but doesn't this look like the abominable snowman from Monsters, Inc.? Oh, the snow cone guy! Yeah. Welcome to the snow cone Himalayas! Yes, he does. Ooh, this looks good. So this is milk chocolates. And, and this is Rudolph. Oh, yours is Rudolph. I love how you've already pre-assigned me Rudolph. <laughs> well, yeah, because, you know. <laughs> Monsters. And then... Monsters University. Oh, oh my gosh! This is like a full stocking. Oh. <gasps> oh! Oh, well, you already have this one, so I guess this one's nice. Yes, and that's the big, that's, oh. this is the new sizing, too. That's amazing. I've wanted one of these, but I was like, eh, I don't need it. I love this print. Just like spirit jerseys, I can't get enough of the new, of having holiday oh masks. Oh my gosh, yes. So this one's everything. This literally kind of matches Johnny's spirit jersey now. And matches your ears. Which is a bunch of gingerbread men with like Goofy and Pluto. So if you watched our previous haul, I actually have that mask already, but so that's why that one is Tim's. And I was thinking about getting this one. This blue, oh, I love this one. And so cute. And I will say, the adjustments that Disney made to their face masks are amazing. Like, they actually are better now. And the large is, uh, they made it a little bit larger. <laughs> oh yeah, I like this. I've never tried on their extra large, but this is nice, so like, when you wash it, if it shrinks a little, it's still fine. And it also is large enough that it can go under your chin and over your nose with, yeah. and talk without it like sliding down. I love when it goes over your chin, because the ones that don't, like, I just feel like... Right? Like a little big man in a little coat, or what's that song? I was gonna say, like, chin diaper people call them when they just... <laughs> oh, God. I, but like, it's so crazy that in 2020, like, I learned how I, like, how my masks We love fit. getting masks. Right? You actually need them and you're recycling them. Alright, there's a few more items that were are very special that I was not expecting in the stocking. <gasps> oh my god, what are those? I'm gonna turn them into Christmas ornaments. Or charm. No, I think it's meant to go on a string. Like one of those... Oh, like a... Like a... Um... Garland. Really? Yeah. Where did oh you find these? Gosh, what are these? Is. These are little Baymaxes. And again, you are completely right that it's hard to find. Yeah, and you collection. could you could put these as ornaments, but since there's so many, I think it'll look really cute with like a nice string decor. You could turn them into earrings. If oh you could turn them into drop earrings, can you imagine? Hold on, God. He makes everything so gay. <laughs> well, it's because I've like done drag and I'm used to like crafting. So like, look, imagine if you like had a cute little pair of like dangle drop <laughs> Baymax earrings. Like, it, you know, all you need is like a hook and I have the adapters. There's nothing I even need to do to these. And I have like a cute little set of Baymax earrings. <laughs> so cute. There, and there are two buttons and two pins. I, oh, the buttons are holiday buttons. I'll show the buttons and then you can start opening the pins. Ooh. So here are our really cute holiday buttons. There's a Mickey Christmas sweater and Donald and Mickey. And something I recently learned about Tim is Tim likes Donald more than I thought he did. Aw, what a sweet pin for Tim. It's Aurora looking lovingly at her Prince Philip. This is how I look at Tim. <laughs> That's nice. Oh my god, you guys, there's so much in here. So much. So we have, he gave me like this little wrapped up present that he assumes is a pin. I don't know if it is though. Let's see. <gasps> no! Oh! oh! It's a keychain of Figaro and Cleo. This is adorable. I've never seen this. Look at how cute that is. Oh my god, this is going on my keychain ASAP. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, okay. I don't even know where to start. No, and, and I think, okay, wow, wow. This is out. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so you I... Guys, this is too much. I'm teal, you're blue. I'll start with teal then. 
Okay, this feels like a mug. Oh yeah, that was on the preference just to, or the criteria. I love this. My best mysterious <laughs> wrap job. So it, <laughs> ow, it hurts. I don't know what it is. For Eric, I love it. Oh, and I oh, love it as Eric. I love tall Christmas mugs. Yes, like this. Eric. Oh, follow your heart. It says, and there's dreamy Eric. That's cute. I love this mug, and I love that it has like this kind of cute tall handle, and it's like really big and deep. Again, I like big sturdy mugs to put beverages in. Follow your heart. This is beautiful. Thank you. Sipping some cocoa. So we put the box on the floor to, I think, make it a little easier. But I will pick something quite <laughs> mysterious. Mine says, I bet you have no idea what it is. I really do. Awesome don't. job on wrapping them up. I really don't. <laughs> I can't wrap them up. I would have had to do it in the box. Uh, uh, this reminds me of like that cake-worthy print of all the villains. Oh, this is beautiful. So you have Ursula, Cruella, Evil Queen, Maleficent, and I like this one because I'm a huge fan of the really big top ones that you could put a lot in because I do not drink coffee. So this will be awesome. I could actually put like SpaghettiOs or hot cocoa and something in there. Mm. All right, let's do one for the both of us. I'm just gonna grab. I imagine open flames and cattails don't mix. Now you can enjoy your fave scent all the time. Ooh. You're right, F open flames and cattails <laughs> don't mix. I don't know what this is though. Oh, it's a diffuser oh. bergamot smudge. Oh, this I is the scented item. And you're right, this is going to be perfect. All right. Created it every day with hearth and hand. Created, created exclusively for Target. Oh, I love exclusive for Target mm -hmm. lines. But Isaac Mizrahi did a great exclusive for Target line. Someone else did, too. I just want to smell this. I don't know how to open it. Oh, there it goes. Oh, it's oh, there's a funnel. Oh, I get it. So you can just open that and just smell right. it. Right. Oh, I think you put the oil in the mm -hmm. thing, and then these go in. So I seem to smell this. I'm going to smell it. How do you describe bergamot? Safety. Um, it's very mannish. Oh, it reminds me of Christmas. It's like cinnamony. Oh, that's really nice. It is kind of like a man, a manly like cinnamon spice. Yeah. It reminds me of like a mulled wine. It's like what I would imagine like a house walking into a elegant Christmas party with. That's smell. like Santa Claus's aftershave. Oh, good, good choice. Thank well you. Done. All right, so I'm gonna pick a blue one. So it says, bundle up. So I love wearing my... <gasps> oh, that's cute. Oh, this is so cute. And it is an ugly Christmas sweater, but it's not ugly at all. And it's of even Wally. Oh, oh this is so cute. I love this. And I was actually tempted to buy this for myself when we saw it at Box yes. Lunch, but I was like, uh, we're in a couple swaps, I just don't know. But I'm so happy to get this, and I think you have this one. Yes, I do, I can be so twins So we can now. be twins, and I love that it has like little, like lights on here. Wait, does it actually light up? Oh, so this is a little different than John's, because his does not light up, but oh my god, let's see. <gasps> Oh my god, this is my new favorite ah! I don't have any that light up. Oh my god! That is a light show. Oh my god, that's awesome. They chase! Oh, that's so... Ah! Oh, thank you guys so much. So you'll be seeing this in an upcoming video for sure. <laughs> oh, that's that so, is so fun. fun! All right, that was blue for you. I'm gonna open the teal, but I see another flat heel thing somewhere that says something to keep you warm. All right, I'm a, I'm gonna go out on a limb. I really can't stay. Baby, it's cold outside. Oh, no. ah! <laughs> That's so funny. 
This is so perfect. Because I have this one. And so, people were saying in a video, like, where did you get that sweater, Tim? It's everything. And I was like, I need that because I love this, like, red and white Hawaiian print. That's really funny. Oh, we could be twins. We can be totally twins. Oh, but there's Stitch and, and it says, Malakaliki Maka. Wait, what? Malakaliki Maka. What did I say? I don't know. <laughs> Look, and you will definitely be seeing this in future videos. I just love the red and white Hawaiian print, and then there's Stitch in the center with Lilo in the back. I love that. Without even realizing, like, what you did, like, that was 100% the perfect, perfect thing for both of us. Yes. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, thank you. <laughs> My gosh, guys, there's so much in So here. much more. All right, so this is a joint when it says, a yummy treat for you two. Oh, those are good. I never knew this existed. But I love Reese's. We love pretzels and chocolate covered or vanilla colored pretzels. Yes. These are Reese's dipped pretzels. Oh, that's going to be so good tonight. I feel like I bought these before and I don't think I shared them with you, which is why you <laughs> never tried them. <laughs> I'm excited to try They're those. the sweet and savory. It reminds me of the Take 5 bar. They're delicious. Alright, I'm gonna go for this tiny item. There's a red and a teal one. It says, oh. we know you love a mystery. It's like we're Scooby-Doo. <laughs> so wait, am I te I'm teal. You're teal. And I'll go first. Alright. And it is what I thought it would be. It's a Lounge Fly mystery Yay. box. Oh, it's the, the, oh, we the kids. Oh, we haven't opened these ones. No! Oh! Loungefly is always making the cutest pins, and we actually love this set, but we haven't opened these ourselves. I want uh, Marie and, or I want Duchess with her, the kittens, the aristocrat. <laughs> we just watched that last weekend, so they're in my head. You can't feel these. Tearing open the bag, and the pin that I have! Oh! Oh, that's cute. This is sweet. It's Mrs. Jumbo and Dumbo! And these are cute pins. Like, they're, they're actually thicker than I thought they would be, but... This is a really solid pin with all the backing and little Dumbo is so tiny. Oh, this is so cute. This movie gives me all of the feels, so thank you. That's adorable. And opening mine, let's see if it's the same set. It is, which is awesome because we didn't get any of these. So I would say I want um, Ariel and Triton or Lady and her kids or Duchess and her. See. We love a mystery unboxing with an unboxing. <laughs> and I have... Uh, <laughs> we have the same one, so it's Dumbo and Jumbo, which is fine, because that'll make a nice trader. Alright, something for the both of us. I'm gonna grab this one. Happy Grinchmas! This freaky festive thing was too fun not to pop in here. So I'm gonna Funko guess it's pop. a Funko Pop. <laughs> was something that we had to do a freaky... A Grinch? A Grinchy item. Oh! oh! Actually, okay. I don't know... This oh. is, we don't have this! We have, oh. we have the mare because we got the mare when we got City Hall but we didn't get her pop. Oh, this is so cute. I think she's so funny. That she, is really She's cute. such a sassy she's man. She's very sassy. Peppermint Lane. It took me forever to figure out what Peppermint Lane was, but then I realized it was Funko's exclusive holiday pop story and narrative. But I don't know. Is there a cartoon? Is there a book? I will say I would like to know what Lady Patty Noble is political stances on things? Does she believe in trimming trees? Clearly, look at her. She's all dressed up and decked out. And how did she get to be elected? <laughs> and So sad, yes. I know, she also looks very young to be a mayor with that side pony. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I haven't seen this in person. Oh, that's adorable. Look at her. So cute. Yay, so I'm gonna pick a joint gift too. It says, you can never have too many of a great mashup. Oh. <laughs> so cute. We do have this, but... We love it yeah, so it's much. so cute. So maybe John and I could just each have our own. But this is Lotso as the little green alien from the Pixar Alien Remix. 
Oh, this is so cute. He's so adorable. It's so funny that they made, it, 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 we've said this all throughout the year that Alien's having a moment, but it's weird that they made him as a plush, but they didn't make a real Funko of this. Yeah. So Funko needs to get on. They might that. be eventually doing it. Let's Cause hope. I know Mattel did. They made some lots of ones. I would get that one. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, thank you. The next thing, oh, we thought these were fun and they're taped together. Mm. All right, let's open. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's an ornament. This is beautiful and perfect oh, for our Christmas tree. We don't tree. have that. No, it's the Headless Horseman. Look at him go. He's riding without a head with a sword swinging in the air, and this is a beautiful Disney sketchbook ornament. And this is a, one of the lighter ones too, so this won't weigh down the branch the way some of the other ones that are super heavy do, but look how delicate this is. And it arrived not broken, like well done. Beautiful packaging. All right, so let's see what mine is. Ooh. This oh, is... that's beautiful. What is this? That is from 25 or 26, Five twenty-six thousand leagues oh, under the yeah. seas. I the thought it was Star Wars at first. I was like, huh? It's the Nautilus. Oh, that's fun. And I've always wanted, I've been on the 25 Leagues Under the Sea ride, now finding Nemo at Disneyland. Uh, Tim is not, obviously, but it's a beautiful ride. That's fun. Yeah, it's always nice to have items that, like, are no more. Right? So that, like, you could always remember them. And it's so cool that, like, that steampunk Jules Verne-esque version of, like, Tomorrowland is what they always thought they should have done. Kind of like they did it with Discovery Bay in Paris. They didn't create a Tomorrowland, they just created a land of a potential tomorrow. Which is why I, it's such pretty over there. Alright, a joint item. Mystery Meow! Is it for Tati? Is it a cat mystery box? Bushi, I don't know. What is it? Oh. Oh my, ah, it's a dome. I love dome. these. I think we bought one of these. We did. Like a couple months ago and we didn't get the one we wanted. No, we got so. two Bengueras. But there is a Figaro in here. Yeah. And a Dino. That would okay. be amazing. Domes are fun. We, we, they're, the, they're like stackable. You can like link them together. We have a couple of stitch ones. But let's just do this right now. We're going to tear this open so it doesn't allow to feel it. And inside they're always wrapped protected. And oh no! Oh. It's another Bagheera! <laughs> oh, it is our destiny to all, not get a Figaro, but there he is. I need to rewatch this movie. I haven't watched this in forever. I don't even, I know he's bad, I think. Right? He's bad. Yeah, that is funny. We literally got this one. <laughs> Aww. But that's cool. I'm sure maybe there's a market for trading those. And thank you for thinking of Disney cats because we do love yeah, our Disney cats. Yeah, so sweet. And, oh my god, there's still more in here, which I can't believe. So kind and generous. Alright. Alright, so there are... Two open okay, last boxes for each of us. There are two more presents and one each. So... I just did the dome, so you get to go. Okay. So we have a really massive box that says Tim. I love this wrapping paper. So pretty. <gasps> oh you my gosh. gosh. It is a red box. Oh, and I it got covered. covered. Well done. Oh my god. That's and, a big Jim Shore and box. Of course, yeah. Red boxes always mean Jim Shore, which we're obsessed with these. And if it's holiday, we don't have barely any holiday ones. So I'm very intrigued to see. Oh, that's sweet. They gave a little, um, what are those called? Gift receipt. Yeah, gift receipt. A little gym short trick is just turn the box upside down and get it out. All right, so cutting it down here just so I don't get it all over my outfit. Okay. So opening it up, oh, <laughs> we do have this oh. one, but it's okay. We literally, Beautiful. we literally just got it, um, but we love it so much. Oh, she's stunning. This is beautiful. So this is the Ursula one, and she has the 
Ariel and the Flotsam and Jotsam. And her back though, yes. Body, adi, adi. And this one is called the Deep Trouble. Ugh. So that is nice. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. Um, we still love this, even though we did just recently get this in a magic mail. But oh my god, it's so It's so cute. beautiful. Thank you. So thoughtful. So nice. All right, last box for me. Johnny, open me last. Smiley face. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, it's a red box. Two red boxes. Jeez, you guys did way too much. Ugh. No peeking. I wonder if there's anyone in the world that sees a spoiler sheet like that and then just rips it open and is like, do you have a gift receipt? I don't know. Yours was inside oh. after you opened it. Oh, I do. A gift. Hope you don't have this one yet from Haley. Aww. Aww. That's so sweet. <laughs> All right, put that down there. Do you have the scissors? I'm following Tim's pro tip of just turning the box upside down. <laughs> You must be like psychics or something <laughs> because literally we did another box up and we got this. I love this figure and it, it I, I did not, I needed That's a Holly amazing. Stitch figure and you truthfully do know us so well and you yeah. wouldn't have known that we had just gotten this like in a swap that, oh, we, I think we filmed that video last weekend. Yeah. So like I, oh, but think you are so thoughtful to have included gifts receipts because I, we yeah, love nice. these so much that we're actually going to probably exchange these for other gym stores and we'll text you and message you which gym stores <laughs> we get so you can see which ones are add to our collections. Oh, that's but beautiful like though. we this is stunning and you have such impeccable taste and there is Stitch and he's trying to wrap us a present for Lilo down there and he has ribbons and he has tape and it says this is called Bad Rap. Oh look at him, little Santa hat. That is really cute though. Like we haven't seen that one other no. than this year. And it's so precious. But you guys did so much. Like to get us stuff that we don't have is hard to do. So, I mean, just the Jim Shores, which we could so kindly exchange because you guys put that in there. But I mean, it's impossible to know like what we have because like, yeah, like we said, we filmed that video last week and it, hasn't gone up by the time we're filming this. So. And we, whatever gym show we get, we will still look at it and think of your generosity nice. and kindness. And really, the 12 channels of Christmas, well, it is about the gifts and we love the gifts <laughs> and the things. It's really about having a chance to connect with each other, to show gratitude for one another in the community. And you have by far ex done that and are just fill our hearts with such love and warmth and kindness and generosity yes. that just make this so much more special. So thank you. And you guys are just so much fun to watch. So everyone be sure to check out Tommy and Haley, uh, Magically Mickey and more. We will link them separately down below. And we will, again, as we said, also link all of the videos to the other 11 channels, so be sure to check them out. Also, be sure to give a special shout out to Nicholas for putting such an awesome swap together. Yes. His first Thank swap. Thank you, Nicholas. Well done. Good job. Awesome job. And we are so happy to have been included in this. If you enjoyed this video, please take a moment to give it a like. And until tomorrow's Vlogmas video, we hope you have a wonderful day. Take care and be well. Bye. Bye.